There's a house across the street, down the hillside, about 400 yards. <laughs> Track lighting's a little dated, but could certainly be updated. And there's a gas fireplace in the upstairs living room above the garage. Upstairs bathroom by the living room. The countertops match the tile. It's a little dated, but very clean. Could certainly be updated to granite or something different, but in excellent shape. The gold stand-up shower could certainly be redone, but functional. The stairs have some pieces of thin carpet on them that could be replaced and updated just for traction, I'm guessing, on the stairs. Nice big sink. Lots of granite in here. Appliances are nice, a little bit older, could be updated. The cabinetry isn't the heaviest of quality, but very nice. Nice tile backsplash. The carpet's starting to look a little bit worn. However, if it is a rental, it makes sense not to replace it immediately because it is still in pretty good shape. And then it's tile throughout the rest of the downstairs living area. And aside from a couple issues that I see underneath the counter, um, it looks like it's been done very well. The main floor guest bath also has a stand-up glassed-in shower, which is very nice. Peeking through the trees about 150 yards away, there is another home up on the hillside. Lots of firewood. Driveway is nice and spacious, not too steep. Lots of room to turn around and park additional vehicles. I'm down closer to the street where you can see the house across the way through the woods. But most of that house is facing Quandary, the peak up there. So they're not really looking your direction up on the hillside. Some kind of fenced in small garden area off to the left there. I don't really see any issues with the siding. Logs all look to be in great shape, well sealed and stained. There's the garden area I was referring to. Indeed, there is a bridge here. Looks like during peak runoff, some water probably comes down here. Looks like a, 
a little creek. As you can see, there's some residual water still here. So this was just to provide access over to the yard here. Quote unquote yard. Again, the siding in the back looks to be in very good shape. I did notice, I guess, some peeling here, um, but nothing major at all. Metal roof with heat tape, easy maintenance. Here's the well pump as well as the hot water heater and furnace. So radiant heat and this would be access to get underneath in the garage. railings and the deck seem very well maintained in great condition obviously a low maintenance composite would be better but they've taken very good care of it I don't see any cracking or substantial issues whatsoever Much more natural light in here during the daytime. Obviously I was here at seven o'clock last night and the sun was starting to go down. Looks like as the sun continues to come up, it's just gonna get brighter and brighter in here. The cabinetry and drawers are quite nice. They have that auto close mechanism. So kind of like they've done here, have the garage act as a place to hang your coats and put your boots and stuff on. I'd maybe even put a bench in right there just for ease of taking on and off shoes and boots. But the garage is quite large and heated. Metal roof in very nice condition here in the back. This would be south facing. Siding back here looks great as well. A few issues that just need to be touched up with some stain or paint. That windowsill could be repainted, but 